nights for that parking lot. Pretty hotel and a swinging hot stop. Don't it always seem to go? But you don't know what you got till it's gone. They paid paradise for that parking lot. I'm part of the Irish Harvard movement and um, my name is Tracy. Um, I'm here today because at our annual conference we were refused entry to this pub, um, Wotherspoon's pub, and this is why we're doing the protest today. We were told into our faces because we were travellers and anyone that associated with us or that was associated with the, with the conference wouldn't be allowed in. If there were signs on that door saying no blacks, no Irish, no dogs, we would be up in arms. If you went to the door here and they said you can't come in because you're Jewish, because you're Catholic, because you're Protestant, we'd be up in arms. So why is it right that they can say no to travellers? The answer is it's not. I've been involved in the Tra Traveller Solidarity Network for the last few months because I was uh, appalled by what was going on at Dale Farm. And uh, I live here. And imagine my shock when I realised that stuff was going on here on my doorstep. If it can happen here on my doorstep, it can be happening anywhere in the country. And it confirmed and reinforced my belief the importance of having a movement of solidarity. That's why we're here today, to say to people, we're not going to stand by and see people in our community discriminated against. Lord said to me, we've been there before. For centuries the leaders have long been at war With us gypsies and travellers who refuse to conform To their houses and taxes and their feuds 